Welcome to my second channel. Hey, hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to my second channel. As you can tell, your girl is back with another video. And yes, yes, yes. You guys have been asking me for an updated makeup routine. So as you guys know, I kind of do like a natural face all the time. And I haven't um I haven't really showed y'all my routine recently, and you guys wanted to see it, so we're gonna get into the video. But make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn on your post notification, hit your thumbs up button, and comment down below. Team Aerie all day, every day. And also, you guys, send me some content ideas that you guys would like to see me do and try. Um, I know they say that Georgia is opened up, but your girl is kind of staying in. You gotta let the first batch go and then, yeah. But let's go ahead and get into the video. All right, so the first thing I use is my Anastasia brow pencil. Um, I believe the kind that I use is ebony. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and do the bottom and kind of trace whatever shape that I have. I really have weird shaped eyebrows. A lot of, um, you know, MUAs tell me that when they do my makeup, like, yeah, you have weird shaped eyebrows, but they're doable. So I'm going to do them. And um, I'm just filling them in as best as I can on both sides. And then I'm going to go ahead with my LA Pro Girl Concealer. This is Toffee and Fawn mixed together. Uh, I'm not really sure who put me onto this trick, but um, I just mix them together because this is what they do. And I am not a professional MUA. I don't know what I'm doing. I ain't took no class. I'm just a girl who look weird when her eyebrows and her face ain't done and her hair is, you know what I'm saying? So then I go over the top, just clean it up a little bit and I learned this technique where you connect them so they can kind of be even on both sides. Your eyebrows are supposed to be sisters, not twins, ladies and gentlemen, not twins. And I'm still in the process of learning this just as you guys can see, I'm in the process of still learning how to do my eyebrows. So right now I'm just blending it in and then, um, I don't know. I think they look kind of cute. You know, I definitely need some work. So I'm not going to act like, you know what I'm saying? These are the bomb.com, but they bomb to me. Shoot. So I'm just going to go ahead and keep blending it in. And then I go in with my prime and moisturizer. And I just mix it into my face. And I know my hands probably look always ashy when I do my makeup. But I always wash my hands before I start. And I never put lotion and stuff on them before I do my makeup. Because I just don't want them, you know, to, you know, break out my face. And, you know, just yeah so um i learned this little technique so that way it can have like a more of a blended a blended um ombre in the front and yeah so now i'm just taking out my hair so you guys can see i got my hair done professionally it's the same wig just reinstalled um after i went ahead and reinstalled if you want to go ahead and check out that video and so now i'm just going to go ahead and try to touch up the baby hairs with a little bit of mousse and my little edge control brush and i'm not doing too much i'm literally going over what she has just trying to maintain them because i feel like that's the problem and then i went ahead and pinned my hair back and i went over it with some got to be spray glue and tied it down i didn't spray it with the glue i kind of sprayed it on my counter and like dabbed it over my head and now i'm able to do my foundation because if you don't do that you're gonna be really irritated trying to do your edge on top of foundation so now i'm adding foundation onto my face and i'm just blending it in i have a um, clean little uh blender and I clean my brushes because I noticed that the cleaner my brushes were or my blender, my beauty blenders, then the better that my face blended in together. So I'm just going to keep on blending and everybody know you got to go in with the blending. You try to, you know, make sure your lighting is right. But if you got the right foundation, you should be okay. You just got to keep blending until you feel like you are doing the right thing, ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen. So I'm just blending in like I'm blending in like a crazy person because I feel like this is very important. And I use NARS Medium um, Dark 5. Um, I've tried Fenty. And um, I, I haven't really tried any other uh, products outside of this. I'm very interested. So if you know anything that I should try, definitely comment down below. And, you know, I would definitely try it out. So, yeah. So I'm still blending. And after I blend, I go ahead in with my LA Pro Girl and um, Toffee and Fawn combination. And I go under my eye. And I go all the way down to my nose, like the little bridge. It's like I'm making this little... Um, 
like a little curve. It's like I'm going with the shape of my face, kind of where you want these highlighted moments to be. I really don't know what none of this do, but when I seen other people do it to my face, I come out cute. And so um, I put it over my forehead and put it under my nose, all connected, as you can see. And I just blend it all in, of course, with a different colored, um, a different colored brush. You have to use a different color. I mean, a different color. Um, beauty blender don't use the same one because you don't want your colors to mesh together and so I just blend it in as best as I can I'd be a little scared with the um, eyebrows then I go in with my banana deep I put a little bit too much on my face but it's okay you know what I'm saying nothing we can't fix Dr. Airy coming in through the building you know what I'm saying so now um, I'm just going through with my big brush and I'm just blending out my face trying to get all the powder off so I think this is setting your face, y'all. I really don't know. Please do not come to me for makeup advice. I'm just showing y'all what I know and what I do. And then I go in with my MAC um, setting spray. And I just spray it all over until my face feel like it is drenched, drenched, drenched. Because when I be in them chairs, they be using three different types of sprays on my face. And I usually try to like switch out my sprays. So if you have any suggestions, comment down below. And I hand, hand swing my face until it's dry. Is that a thing? Hand swing? I hand dry? Hand hand face I don't know but still now it's time for the lashes baby girl hey and then I'm going in with my um, highlighter and I'm just hitting my nose blend it out with my my um, finger on the top of my lip and a little bit on my chin and my cheeks okay and then I clean off my lips with some makeup remover go in with like the light pencil if I'm doing a lip today and I just did a lip with you guys today because I could find my lip pencil I go in with this moisturizing lip and follow with beauty um I don't I think it's the Fenty and then now we have the final look like hey girl hey <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video and to see my updated makeup routine um I feel like I do the same thing but y'all wanted to see it updated so yes here it is um I feel like I'm getting a little bit better I definitely still have a lot of work to do with my eyebrows but um I'm actually really proud of myself like I could have never been able to do this like last year and I feel like I'm getting a little better like I just need of course some more practice Definitely, but I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching this video like comment subscribe turn your post notification Hit your thumbs up and comment down below and yes Like I said send me some content ideas anything that you want me to try anything that I should buy anything like that um, I want you guys to know that I love you and um, If you're new welcome to the family and if you were OG What's up? All right, I'm out. <laughs> Peace